I wish I knew. Welcome back to My Husband is My Best Friend. Sherry Shepard speaks on the 4.8 magnitude earthquake that hit New York City. I mean, that's me, but what was the show with Captain Kirk? And the Crow Magnum, he had that forehead. That's what I look like. Was was that man on Captain Kirk? LeVar Burton played him. Had all of that big, big old forehead. The D loves you. Thank you so much. Star Trek. I look like the Crow Magnum from Star Trek. The, the wig is back too. The wig is back too far. We're gonna have to unglue it and glue it here, um, cause it's too far back. <laughs> Let me see. Uh, I just noticed that in the hotel room. I didn't notice that, but now that I'm looking. The way you be roasting yourself. If you can't roast yourself, something's wrong. Uh, and I have to be honest. I love the wig. The, it's beautiful. But it makes my forehead look like a five head. Like, so I'm trying to do this. <laughs> Why is this so stupid? <laughs> like, fair faucet. I'm trying to, like, put it because it's too far back. I feel like George Jefferson. <laughs> from, from George Jefferson from Good Times. Bitch, what? So don't be sure to like share and subscribe we felt the earthquake in philadelphia oh my gosh that's horrible oh my goodness and you know instead of like playing um music soldier i need to be playing jesus you're the center of my joy all that's good and that's the gospel we go through earthquakes all the time here. All right, love stands with us all. Want to be bougie with the earthquakes. Want to own the earthquakes. Want to be territorial with your earthquakes. Oh, uh, y'all ain't nothing. We go through earthquakes all the time. We don't. Not in New York. Good morning, auntie. Hey, embrace your forehead. God gave it to you. No, he didn't. God, this is the forehead God gave to me. This is the forehead I got from wigs. Wearing wigs too long. I'm not blaming all of this five head on God. Well, what's September 3rd? Are you into uh, Zodiac signs? September 3rd? That's a Virgo. That's a Virgo. What are, what are Tauruses and Virgo? Anybody know what a Taurus and a... Virgo, Taurus, Taurus and a Virgo. Are they compatible? They're compatible. They like to argue a lot. They like to argue a lot. But that's, not that's, not that's not compatible. That's not compatible. You argue on Uh Have you talked to Kim? I have. I talk to Kim all the time. So, yes. That's a yes. Uh, Hoover. Yes. We're actually in Hoover, Alabama. But I say Birmingham, Alabama. But I'm at the Star Dome Comedy Club. This is where I will be performing tonight. And I'm saying I have tickets available for my 930 show on Friday and Saturday. For tickets, go to SherryShowTV.com. And I'm going to get off uh, because I'm just running my mouth. Oh, Capricorn, Virgo, and Taurus work very well. I don't know what the Capricorn is. September 3rd, like September 2nd, September 3rd. How is that with the, with the Taurus? Somebody tell me that. Is, are they opposites? Taurus and no, they're not. Leo and Cancer. Y'all, no, I don't, I don't want a Leo. What is Leo? Leo's in August, ain't it? August. I was married to two Leos. My daddy's a Leo. My son was almost a Leo, but he came early, so he's a Taurus like his mama. So don't bring me Leo. I don't want a Cancer. I want to know what the Virgo is. September 3rd. Um, did I feel the earthquake? I did not because I'm not in New York. You giving Oprah looks. <laughs> well, yeah, there we go. I like that. Thanks for tuning in to My Husband is My Best Friend.